In this tutorial, we are going to talk about the scene building aspects in SimLab Composer and how it can help architects improve their overall 3D design without much effort. This is a 3D model of a house designed in SketchUp and we are going to surround the house with fences to add more character to it. Go to the 3D model library and select the fences category where you will find several 3D models designed for that purpose. Drag and drop the wooden gate thumbnail onto the 3D area to add it to the scene. Place the gate at the beginning of the pathway leading to the house's main entrance, using the translate tool that can be toggled by pressing 2 on the keyboard. Once the gate has been placed properly, proceed by adding the left side fence section to the 3D area. Move the fence section in place to the left of the wooden gate. To accurately and easily place the fence, press 5 on the keyboard to toggle the Auto Alignment option. Auto Alignment has a smart collision detection system that can accurately place an object according to its surrounding. Notice that a bounding box has been created around the selected object and when the object is moved in the 3D area, the bounding box snaps to connect to the object next to it. You can now add another left side fence section from the library or you can duplicate the fence that has already been added to the scene. You can press Ctrl and C on your keyboard to create a copy of the fence, or you can press Ctrl and T to create an instance. Instances are duplicates that have their attributes linked to the original object. Press F4 on the keyboard to start the real-time rendering. Select the IES light in the original fence and change its power value. Notice how the light's power dropped in both fences and not only the original. This is due to the second fence being an instance of the original fence, whereas if they were a copied replica, each fence would have its own unique attributes that are not linked to each other, and when needed to be changed, they have to be manually changed one by one. Press Ctrl and T on the keyboard to create more replicas of the fence, and with the auto alignment option toggled on, Place the fence sections next to each other. To create a corner, rotate the section 90 degrees and snap it to the column of the last fence section. You can select multiple objects at the same time and create instances for them using the Ctrl and T hotkey. Add the right side fence to the scene and position it on the other end of the wooden gate. Proceed with creating instances of the section and place them next to each other. Rotate the fence 90 degrees to create a corner and continue placing more section till you close the fence surrounding the house. Once you get to the last corner, remove the column part that is overlapping with the existing column.
You can also remove the columns placed at the corners and replace them with a section specially designed to serve as a fence's corner. Drag the corner from the library onto the scene, then press N on the keyboard and click on the ground to snap it to that location. Now, using the auto alignment option that can be toggled by pressing 5, place the corner in its correct position. Rotate the other corner 90 degrees and place it using the auto alignment system. SimLab Composer's goal to aid architects in performing their tasks with simplicity and ease is reflected in the powerful tools the application provides. With the smart synergy between those tools, accomplishing tasks no longer requires a lot of time and effort.